Hello guys, and this is Riri Divine with Riri Divine Tarot, and I am here today to do your general love reading. Um, the deck that I am using is the Fountain Tarot, and I put three cards for your past, present, and future. And I'm going to go ahead and get into your reading, but before I get into the reading, I do want to let you guys know that this is a general reading, so it will not resonate with everyone. All right, with that being said, let's go ahead and get into it. At the bottom of the deck, we have the seven of coins or the seven of pentacles. So you may be planting seeds in your love life. You may be planting some seeds and I feel like you might be putting in some work as well because we got the three of wands under that as well. So I feel like you're planting some seeds. All right, and in the past energy, we have the strength card. Now the strength card talks about um being bold and being confident which i feel like aries that's you um that's your energy you are very bold and spontaneous and i feel like or there could also be a leo because this is the card of leo as well but i feel like you might just be being bold um i clarified that and we have the eight of pentacles so the eight of pentacles speaks about putting in effort and not only just putting in effort but it being worth the effort so you might just be feeling like this is worth the effort. Something, a relationship or whatever it is, um, even if you're single and might just be out mingling, you might have found a Leo or you might be interested in the Leo, but you might feel like it's worth, something is worth the effort. All right. In the present, we have the chariot. Chariot is the card of cancer. So there could also be a cancer involved in this situation. Well, this is about just being determined, willpower, moving forward. And I clarified that and we have the world. So it's like you're determined to have everything. You feel like you deserve everything, which I don't blame you. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you feel like you deserve everything, then you deserve it. Point blank. <laughs> All right. In the future, we have the Knight of Coins or the Knight of Pentacles. So there may be an earth sign um, involved in this situation as well. But this, the Knight of Pentacles, this energy just kind of, kind of moves a little slow. Taking your time, um, not rushing things, being strategic, having a plan. This is your future energy. Um, I clarified that and we have the five of wands. So there might be some competition going on. There might be a little bit of competition going on here. Um, you may be in competition with an earth sign or, you know, you could actually be having words with an earth sign. Be careful with that type of energy coming into the future. All right. So I did put some Oracle cards for you guys and the deck that i am going to use is the power of love and i've already shuffled them and i'm going to go ahead and read them out now the first card that we have was unity unity speaks of you understand that the love shared with another is amplified and has a ripple effect across the universe so i feel like in the past energy you were feeling like you know this is worth the effort you was coming together you was on one accord with somebody you guys were on in unity together that this is going to be worth the effort um and in the present we have freedom freedom speaks of you are releasing any self-imposed restrictions or perceived limitations through the loving energy of openness so i feel like right now i feel like you are determined that you deserve everything you feel like you feel i feel like you feel like you deserve everything so I feel like you are releasing anything, any type of restrictions, anything, any limitations. You you are letting go of any type of limitations. You feel like you deserve everything. You feel like you deserve the world. And the last part we have is elevation. You are making the conscious decision to raise your vibration of love. So I feel like there may be a little bit of competition um, coming in or you could be having words with an herb sign. Or somebody who has earth in their chart. But this person just moves slow. You might feel like they might need to pick up the pace. You might feel like, I you know, I feel like I deserve this. But I feel like you're not putting in, you know. You might just feel like that might be taking their time. And you're trying to elevate this situation. You want to see the, the situation 
you know, elevate, but they might be taking their time. And then you might be having a little bit of words about, you know, how slow they're moving as well. That's that's uh, something to think about as well, too. All right, guys, this is going to be your general love reading. And thank you guys so much for tuning in. This is Riri Divine with Read Divine Tarot. And I will see you guys next week for your weeklies. Thank you for tuning in. Have a good one.